Hello, welcome back to the channel. It's JPA here. In today's video, I'm going to be discussing Rangers versus Aberdeen Ibrox today. If you're new to the channel, please think about hitting that subscribe button and we'll hit the like button as well. And we'll just get straight into this video. Time to, to do a proper video for this. Uh, injury wise, we've got a couple injuries. Um, Kemal Roof is probably going to be it for a couple of weeks. He's got a, a scan, I think it's his groin area. Um, obviously he came off at half time against the uh, play Livingston and um, Yilmaz seems to be okay I think he'll probably make the squad I don't know if he'll, he'll start or not we've, obviously Michael Beale was saying in the presser that we've got two uh, really really good left backs and we've got obviously a lot of cover in that area so it could be Barisic it could be Yilmaz the, f the fact that Yilmaz take a wee bit of a knock I'm expecting uh, Barisic to play to be honest with you but then We've got the game on Thursday in Europe, where obviously Yilmaz can of play, so that kind of obviously comes into effect as well. Uh, in terms in terms of strikers, we're down to pretty much the bare bones, and uh, Michael Beale pretty much said in the press conference who would be starting, which will be Sima, Lammers and Dessers. Not sure which positions this, those three will start in. I uh, don't know if it'll be a front, front three, will we kind of change the formation up a little bit and play two tens? Uh, or would, do we play the two wide men and have... Uh, Dessers up front, Lammers up front. I don't know how he's going to play it. He's, he did suggest that uh, Seema can equally play up there as well. So it's going to be interesting to see how he lines up up front. Obviously, the likes of Todd Cantwell. Um, Dill, I think, is uh, on the recovery, but he won't make it this game. Uh, Cantwell obviously won't make it. Uh, Lawrence is going to be in a couple of weeks as well. So we, we do have a lot of injuries to worry about. Uh, that's not obviously been said in the press or that. It's... Uh, it's all doom and gloom apparently if you if you hear the I don't know if you've seen the press conference or no but it's it's all it's really it's actually quite bad. It felt really bad for Sammers. I apologise I call him I called him Lammers early. Obviously his name's Sammers on this channel. Uh, but I felt bad for him because the, the, the way the questions were kind of uh, constructed it was like uh oh, you've been playing really badly and the fans have reacted really badly. How'd you take that? It wasn't a really nice question and to be honest with you, any the the guys were really really getting in on it but he did well uh, in his answers I, th I felt sorry I keep looking around people looking at me um, I felt he did quite well with his answers but I thought they were really poor questioning by the, the uh, so Aberdeen we'll look at them a little bit uh, their form has been great uh, I think they're what, second bottom they now in the table but they have had two wins in the last two games uh, albeit against Ross County who are the greatest side in the league um, but we all know that form kind of goes out the window in these games. It's almost like an old firm, if you will. Um, Aberdeen are really fierce rivals with Rangers. Um, and they always try their best. This is their cup final. They didn't seem to try quite as hard against Celtic, mind you. But when it comes to Rangers, this is the game they want. The one game of the season where they really play well. They've only... Um, if I was an Aberdeen fan, I'd be really annoyed, to be honest, with the fact that they only seem to turn up four times a year, and that's when they play us. Um, there is a potential cup final uh, with, with them if they can beat Hibs and we can beat Hearts uh, that's for another day's talking but that could be another exciting fixture for us uh, I'll just go into my prediction now as I say I've not, I'm kind of running out of time to do this video uh, I'm going to go Rangers 1 Aberdeen 0 um, goal scorer for me I'm going to go Sammers I think he'll he's due a goal he was in the presser feeling a little bit confident he says he says feels he's, he's adapting the team a little bit better so I'm going to go for Samers for the goal uh, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below uh, and we'll just end the video there guys thank you very much for watching and hopefully I'll see you in the, in the next video uh, I don't know if I'll be able to do a reaction for this video I've got a lot of things coming up uh, over this weekend or this week so I'll, I'll try and get a video done but if not I'll see you as, as soon as I can